Dash. This car has a lot of dash. What's going dash. on, guys? Cerebro here for T3G. And full throttle. Hold on. There we go. Let's turn down the copyright. We just got some uh, some coffee at Cups and Vine. Cup, in cup, cup, cup and, and Vine. Cup and Vine. In Schaumburg. In Schaumburg, Illinois. It's uh, not bad. It's better than Starbucks. Maybe. <laughs> For me, it is. I'm not a fan of Starbucks he coffee. Starbucks. Uh, regular coffee. Regular coffee. Let's coffee. Not, not, right, not, not like the sugar laden the, stuff because he yeah. loves sugar. I had to drag him out of there. Yeah. He saw, saw a biscotti or something. I was, yeah, I was ready for that <laughs> malt, molten chocolate. I was ready for that molten chocolate. <laughs> so, what's going on, guys? So, we thought we'd do a little vlog. I'm uh, actually, we're doing it on the Note 4. We're trying to see Your how the, is yeah, we're trying to see how the um, stabilization works uh, and the quality, of course, the, the front camera quality. Um, before we did it on my Samsung Galaxy 4 and that was a good I mean that overall was a good phone I mean yeah. camera wise and everything and absolutely but this clearly I mean I can even just looking at it right now it looks sharp it, it looks, looks sharp, sharp. Oh, that screen that, that screen that quad, quad HD screen <laughs> that screen is pretty ridiculous but yeah, we're quad gonna go. HD, I got the LG G3 yeah, uh, we're gonna as well. review that as well so um, do a little comparison on all the cameras uh, yeah, because that's that's kind of the big thing, uh, especially you know for us, we do a lot of video recording. So, video recording quality on these phones is very very crucial. Uh, we want to make sure that uh, we have the right technology and that it, yeah. it has the best quality we can get. Yeah, no, definitely. I mean, that's the thing about the phones in general and the technology nowadays is you can basically record on anything. Yeah, and release a video like YouTube and stuff like that and yeah, well, it's we can possible, release this now. You know? So it's uh we can it's, live stream off of it's our great to see I mean it's it's just crazy because I was actually watching uh side by side. Mm -hmm. It's a documentary of film. Sure. Um, and uh, Keanu Reeves was the narrator, the one asking all the questions to all the directors and stuff like that. Okay. And it's just crazy how they're talking about going from film and into digital and the insane amount of work like there's still insane amount of work in editing but obviously with film you had to cut physically physically cut it, yeah. cut it paste it and it's just it's insane to see how the te technology increased in the digital world because you know back in the day they were talking about how film was so much better than digital because standard definition was terrible let's be serious i mean yeah I mean, 35 millimeter compared to a yeah. like a you know two three four megapixel camera right. 35 millimeter one out all day oh, every all day. day no questions about it because you could blow up 35 millimeter to poster size and it's perfect but exactly. five megapixel you just lose that quality but yeah but that's just some tangent so yeah we're gonna go get some food now we got some coffee uh, we could have gotten some stuff there, but I, I was, I don't know. Too much sweets. Yeah, too many sweets. Too much sweets, not like enough that. healthy options. Yeah, we're trying to be a lot healthier. I mean, I'm generally a little better about being healthier, but anytime I go I'm out, talking trash about me, right? No, no, I'm no, right here, no, 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 no. But let's be serious. <laughs> when I go to Portillo's and when you go to Portillo's, <laughs> that's true. It used to be a lot different, <laughs> but um, now I don't go to Portillo's no more. But yeah, it's tough. We were just talking about it. It's it's so much harder when you go to go eat somewhere mm -hmm. and try to save calories and when you actually try to eat at home and obviously oh yeah and it's because you're you're able to choose what you're using and the calorie you know type of bread and stuff like that so uh that's all the calorie savings where when you go to a restaurant they pick the you know the most the highest thing with calorie but why because it tastes, it tastes better good, yeah so, i mean they, they're picking you know, they're you know if you go out to eat the, the restaurant or you know whatever is they're choosing flavor yeah. they're not choosing health in most cases now most there are cases, some locations right. that you know like not necessarily subway but you know but it more, is more example. like deli style right. places that do have uh, more either give you the option right. or if they're making it they make it with a lower calorie bread or uh, in a wrap specifically uh, there's a place in Villa Park we actually we should go check that out I forget what it's called leaf something um, but they they do exclusively wraps, um, so they limit oh, the amount of cool. you know carb calories you yeah. can get the, the amount of carbs. Um, so they, they they do exclusively exclusively wraps and they do all healthy stuff. Um, so it's somewhat like Subway, but they're they're more geared towards being healthy. Okay. So it's 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 the, you know that kind of stuff that you got to keep an eye out for, especially in today's market. There's a lot of people that are doing 
that kind of, you know, just a variety, like a difference from what's been there. Um, you know, as much as I love Portillo's, uh, you know, I have to find some variety. You know, yeah, I've, absolutely. I've, I've started eating at Subway again, and that e even in, in and of itself is a better move. And that at Subway, I still have to make that better decision. Yeah. So, yeah, could I go to Portillo's and order a, a salad? Sure. But you don't go but to Portillo's. But if I'm going Let's to Portillo's, serious. I'm not going to Portillo's to order Me salad. Me neither. Me neither. I'm as healthy to... conscious as I am, I do not order a salad. I, I got to have the beef. I yeah. got to have the beef. So, and when if I'm at Portillo's, is only like if I go to Portillo's in the year 2015, <laughs> it's going to be a cheat day and I'm going to order absolutely. whatever I yeah, want. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And I'm yeah, going to order absolutely. whatever I want because I'm not going to go. Like, that's. That to me is going to be a treat. That, yeah. That's not going to be, you know, I, I went there a lot last year, especially towards the end of last year, since yeah, I didn't really go anywhere. We had some car problems at the house, so uh, my car is always gone. So Portillo's is pretty much the closest thing that's you know reachable by walking distance, and um, it, it's very much a matter of a convenience. So that was that was a huge thing. So what we did is we spent a bunch of money on groceries, so now I make food at home. Yep. So I don't have to go and go out and eat. Uh, and then I, I've pretty much given up on fast food i mean i haven't i haven't been to mcdonald's i'm not yeah, planning on going to mcdonald's um you know that's uh, yeah subway is i think the closest it gets. i think the biggest thing is is even though i'm a healthy conscious person mm -hmm. i i love the reason fast food always appeals to everybody i think is because it's fast food you don't make it you go in you order you get it and it's, it's a convenient thing like okay and yes do you have to drive there mm -hmm. yes but, but it's I usually don't have on to your prep way. it. I it's usually, it's on, usually your way. on your way to something you know, else that you want to do. You're going home. You want dinner. You don't want to have to sit there and make dinner and then eat. You want to just eat. And I understand that. I completely understand that. But there, there is a term that we use in America a lot. It's called you pay you pay for convenience, right? Mm -hmm. So people will pay more money to get stuff now. Yeah. Uh, you know, so people you can order stuff online and get a lot cheaper stuff. You know, anything, phones, computers, whatever. You can order it online people, and it's going to be cheaper. But people will go to the store and buy it because they want it today. Well, no, yeah. But there's a flip side to that in terms of food. Yes, you do pay for convenience, but on the other side of it. You don't pay for convenience. Usually convenience is cheaper. Right. So McDonald's is going to be cheaper than going out and buying the ingredients you need to make dinner. Oh, absolutely. Because you're gonna, when you buy ingredients for dinner, you Especially can't. Especially healthy you, ingredients? Right. You can't buy ingredients for one dinner. Like that's, it's a waste of money. Basically, because you're 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 buy one pepper, you're gonna buy you know half an onion. Yeah. You can't buy these no, things. No. So at at McDonald's, you're gonna buy something for six bucks, but you're gonna pay for it on the other side of that, on the health side of it. So oh, you absolutely. you pay you pay a higher price in health by by doing convenience. You know, it, it's just it's it's a big thing to consider. I mean. I, obviously, we all live very busy lives. Oh yeah. Uh, you know, everybody's everybody works. Everybody works a lot. Uh, to make ends meet, uh, not even not even to live well these days, but just to make ends just meet. Make Everybody's ends working meet. Yeah, a absolutely. lot, and it's one of those things that you have to you have to make those conscious decisions. And if if it means stocking up on hundred calorie granola bars, stock up on hundred calorie granola bars. Keep one in your pocket if you're hungry. It's <laughs> funny that you say that because I was just talking about I just got these Quest bars, mm -hmm. and they're really healthy for you. You know, very low on sugar, one gram of sugar. Uh, I forgot the grams. I think it's like. I want to say 16 grams of fiber and 20 grams of protein. Nice. Very low on fat. Very healthy for you. And it's 180 calories. But, I mean, you're getting all the necessities that you need. And you can bring with you anytime, you know. Yeah. You just eat, eat one. And it's not supposed to be a meal replacement. But it is supposed to help you. I mean, that's the whole point of protein and stuff like that. It's supposed to help you. Uh, you're going to feel hungrier when you're reducing carbs and, you know, gaining protein. I can attest but, to that. <laughs> but it, it is a healthier choice. Uh, while when you're not, because the whole thing behind carbs is, is you can use it for energy, but 90% of the people don't use, they store carbs sure. as fat instead of burning it as energy. So Yeah, I mean, if you're, if you're a runner, if you're, if you're out there every single day grinding, you know, for your health, Eat all the carbs you want. Right. You you hit you know you hit that Portillo's. You get the big beef, lots of carbs. Go nuts. You know, go planners, as they say. <laughs> um, but if you're not, you know, if you are like myself, who you know, I work from home, or you work an office job where you're you, sitting down, you sit down in your car, down. you walk the distance from your car to your office, you sit down in your office, and then you repeat that distance to your car, and that's pretty much all the walking you do in a day. Right. 
you need to elim you need to eliminate carbs. Yeah. That was the biggest thing I did last last time around four years ago when I when I was really successful is I eliminated carbs yeah. and I went from no joke. I mean, you guys are gonna I mean maybe not maybe not not believe me, but you guys are gonna be maybe a little surprised. I hope. Um, I used to hit four to six pieces of toast. Four eggs at the least, four to oh, six yeah. eggs. But even I can do that. Yeah, it's, and, it's and, an easy and by thing, itself, you know? that's not necessarily a bad thing. Somebody's in trouble. Yeah. But by itself, that's not a bad thing. Uh, you know, four to six eggs. I was told by a trainer is not a bad thing, right? Exactly. Four to six eggs, as long as you are using it, right? Right. Exactly. There's, there is a lot of fats in eggs. It is healthy fats, but, but it's it's you, a lot of. It. If you use it, if you're working, sure. right? If you're lifting, four to six eggs is that's part of your daily. So that's, you know, a high, high protein breakfast is going to make you l be awake better and sleep better. Oh, yeah, yeah, so, sure. you know, it, it's very much the matter of what you're intaking. You know, I used to have the, you know, four to six pieces of toast. I went from that to zero pieces of toast. Right. So that was a complete elimination of, of, of all carbs. And I really, I don't even think I had any other carbs. I mean, I had, that was when I went really, really super lean. I, I was kind of broke at the time, so it was very much yeah. a matter of I wasn't eating much. And then the only carbs I had were at, at uh, for dinner when I was at work. I used to work right by a, a, Greek, a Greek deli, I guess, a Greek restaurant. Right. Um, so I would have, like, um, either a chicken wrap or... Um, like a chicken pita pocket. Okay. Um, so that so was pretty. Much, that was right. yeah. So that was a, that was the extent of um, the carbs I would have in a day. Outside of that, it was eggs, like eggs with vegetables and a, a sprinkling of cheese and um, nuts. Like I would, I would bring nuts or granola bars and just tons of water. And like th that's the other thing. Even like any kind of nut is. They're good for you because they do have fiber, mm -hmm. right? But they do have fats. But once again, it's those healthy fats. So it's just you're, you can, that you're you can burn eat quickly. the stuff. It's just you have to pay attention to how much you're intaking. You know, Absolutely. like uh, most people will tell you uh, a good amount of, uh, you know, any kind of nut to have throughout the day is, uh, is a handful. That's what you should eat. If you can grab a handful of peanuts or, you know, whatever you like, walnuts. I like uh, cashews. Yeah. I'm a big fan of cashews. So Pistachios are good. Uh, pistachios. I'm sorry. That's the one. Pistachios. I'm a big fan of pistachios. So you can just uh, like a handful of... Uh, any which, is about of a, which is about a yeah. quarter quarter cup, maybe yeah. to a half cup. For me, maybe it's a half cup. Right. <laughs> so, and and that's what you're supposed to eat. Now, if you eat more than that, of course, then your your body's intaking more of that stuff and, and it's going to be tougher for it to burn. But speaking yeah, of it's <laughs> Yeah, speaking of Portillo's, which is funny, is where the subway is. <laughs> oh, that's true. Yeah. Right. I guess I never did realize that. Yeah, I guess I guess yeah. the subway was in walking distance too. Yeah. My own fault. I was just being a fat guy. I I remembered it like a while back that there was a subway here. I'm like, oh yeah, there's one right by his house. Why did we drive all the? It was one time when I was going with Dino. Right. Red X, should we say? Um, but yeah, that, that's a little tangent about health stuff and food. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be so, doing a lot. Call, call it a health vlog. A health vlog. That's what we'll call it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna be doing uh, quite a bit. Uh, he just got a tablet and a phone uh, yeah, because they yeah, had it was, it was a, an awesome deal. It, it was, was a good free, deal. Free phone, free G tab, so free reviews is kind of what right? I saw. I'm not even gonna lie. That's exactly how I thought about it. I said free phone. Man, it's smaller than the Note Three, but it's free and it's a review and it's a new phone. Yeah. Why not? Why not? And then I got the Note Four. I'm gonna do the wipes. I keep saying it, but the uh, Samsung uh, tablet, the 12 inch yep. tablet, I gotta yep. do that because it's, it's, you'll see it in the review. But uh, extended do warranty them. got a couple new things, so right. she's gonna be doing some reviews as well. Uh, I don't know if Reddick's got anything new that he might review. He's released a few videos on his newer stuff. He's got a he's got a movie review coming up. Yeah, uh, that's the other thing we're gonna be doing. Uh, like, the yeah, we're gonna be uh, mid season. Well, not, How does it's that? just well, what we're gonna be doing. Is we're gonna be we're, reviewing the shows that the, we so basically the did the roundup on. Um, we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna try to do kind of a monthly thing to see kind of how it's going. Um, the big thing that they've said recently is that the Mar uh, Agents of Shield, right. the end of Agents of Shield, is supposed to go straight into the the Marvel or the. Um, Avengers. Avengers. Okay. Um, so that's, I'm pretty excited about that to see how it goes. They just said, um, oh, what's his face? Hawkeye just said he was in, in costume again yesterday. 
Um, reshoots. And but he didn't say what for. He yeah, said, but I, I mean, he said knows? I can't say for what. So well, he could suppo- have been for reshoots, but because he's you know he's but not. But then again, powered, supposedly he's supposed to be in. Um, uh, Agents of uh, Agents of Shield. I heard he was supposed to show. Well, that's up. that's 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 so, what I'm hearing is that you know because he's not super powered, he may actually be able to, to show cool. up on the show. Because I mean, let's be honest, it used to not be cool. It used to not be cool. It used to not be financially feasible. Not even just cool, right? If it used you're to not be financially movie feasible to be on a show. Yeah, because you couldn't get paid movie rates on TV. You just can't. Now, in the new market, when you have Halle Berry. Running a TV show, she's got her own series. She's a star. Matthew McConaughey. Matthew McConaughey rewarded is a, best actor of the year, and he's in his own show. On Granted, t- it's on HBO. Sure, but it's a TV. But it's series. a TV series. So he's got a TV series. Um, Woody Harrelson's with Matthew McConaughey on the same TV right? series. Um, um, man, I'm sure we're missing quite uh, a bit. Jada, Jada Smith is uh, on Gotham or uh, regular. Dread, Dread, and when. Granted, it right. got canceled. It did but, get canceled, but yeah, but that uh, wasn't Carl due. Urban. I, that, that was Carl Fox. Urban was on that yeah, show. Yeah, Carl Urban, but that wasn't due to that wasn't due to the show. That was due to Fox. That's a well, whole and and, and and the funny thing is, they're saying if Gotham fails, yeah, that's the other thing. Like I'm waiting for them to cancel. Well, they're Gotham. saying if Gotham fails, they've they've greenlit, or at least they've they've put into motion something for the pilot of uh, for Lucifer. Which was a, a Vertigo series under under DC. You know what? I just don't <laughs> want them to get anything. I'm a dick. I just don't want. I don't want Fox to get anything. I wanted to all go to every other channel. I would. Yeah. Except, I mean, if they can't stick with it, I really. I really. I don't want, know why they keep getting good shows and they keep canceling. It's it's really. Although annoying. you did say that the first uh, first episode of Gotham was underwhelming for you. Yes, we'll go into review on that. But we'll this well, not the about first a, a episode. The so, first episode coming back. After mm-hmm. the mid-season finale, right. so yeah, but we'll go into that. No, we can do that today. We can talk about one ep- one episode. We don't have to wait till all of them premiere. Yeah, yeah we can. We'll see. We'll see. We can, because dude, that was a long debate about all the shows. That was long. We do, we do weekly. We we'll do weekly. Because I don't think I think because I'm pretty sure Gotham was the first. Because there's not a lot of things coming back until like the 16th. So there's two episodes this week, because we had Go- Gotham and, and so right Agent Gotham. Carter. There was a Gotham last week, hey, and then now we got Gotham and Agent Carter this week. Was that no Gotham was this past Sunday? Oh, was it? Yeah. Oh, is it a Sunday show? I watched it on DVR, so I don't know. Is it Sunday or Monday? I didn't know it was a Sunday show. Is it Sunday or Monday? I think it's a Monday. It's not a Sunday show. I'm gonna say Monday. Then it's got to be this Monday. So it was this Monday. So we got two shows this week. Because I watched it yesterday. Maybe we'll talk about that this week. Yeah, let's watch it. I mean, watch it. Let's talk about it. Well, let's at least... We can do a Gotham, and then when we watch Agent Carter, we can do Agent Carter. We can do it per show. It'd be, it'd be easier, because then we can get out everything for that particular show and not try to rush through it. See, this ideas true. happening on camera. This is true. This is... This is, this is tangents. This is, um, this is tangents, and it's also... Uh, what do I call it? Stream of consciousness. Is, we just Absolutely. Talk. We just the, talk the, talk guys, until you get something that works. Guys, this is, b- believe Fake it or not. Fake it until you make it. We do this on a daily basis, and then he was like, we should, or not him. Actually, it was first like one of our friends, Celeste, I think, was like, you guys should record this. Yeah. Yeah, you we're just like, just we, we just this. talk, and we talk about this stuff, and she's like, we should just put this on camera. This is a good idea. <laughs> But yeah, guys, so we're going to go eat Subway. Um, we're going to do some more videos. Yeah, do some videos. Uh, he's cooking editing some, currently. Cooking some healthy chicken. Yeah, right. He's currently editing. Uh, we might I've do some bowling tonight. Up. Some bowling tonight, possibly, yeah. That's a possibility. That'd be pretty fun. I mean, the wife's up for it. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, mine didn't respond yet, so we'll see. Yeah, well, depends when she, she is working. So depends she'll, be how off in a l- she'll be off in a little bit, but I'm sure I'm sure I can convince her. Oh, I'm sure she'll be. Should be out for it. Yeah. So, yeah, guys, keep a lookout for more videos. We'll probably release something either right before or right after this vlog. And we'll probably do this vlog first. I'm sure of it. It's quick. It's a fast really edit. Do much, yeah. There's not really an edit. Yeah. It's just a render. Our vlogs really are much editing. All we do is put our little logo. I'm telling you. We just got to come up with like a tiny I know, tiny, right? Just gonna, a tiny gonna... sticker <laughs> to put on the lens so it's always got the logo. So we don't even have to edit. We don't have to render it. You just upload. Just like, Upload, please. That'd be pretty awesome. That'd be pretty awesome. Make sure you guys check out that contest. 
uh, annotation somewhere. Yeah, guys, um, we haven't really had a lot of entries for the. Yeah, we have. Have we? Yeah. Maybe I'm not paying attention. Yeah, there's a ton of entries. It's a so, good thing I'm not paying attention. Uh, a bunch of people are in on it. A bunch of people are excited about it. So. But please pay attention because now... Subscribe. Because there's, there's two giveaways that officially we're just... We tried to reach out to like four different people per giveaway. Nobody responded. So we're redoing those as giveaways. So, so on Facebook, make if sure we reach 100 subscribers... 100 likes. I keep... 100 likes. 100 likes. 100 likes on Facebook. If we got 100 likes on Facebook... Um, we will give away the Audio Technica headphones and the um, the other router that we have. We still have the router, other routers, yeah. yeah. So just because the people we try to reach out that originally won those, actually it was like three or four people additional to the original yeah, I, ones. I, I, emails are probably still in people's inboxes. I'm sorry. Sorry, guys. I mean, we waited and we waited and you know, and now it's for other people to get the chance to win it. So yeah. we want and to also, give it to you guys. So please pay attention to like your inboxes on whatever it is. If it's YouTube, Facebook, which is probably the two that it's going to be on. Cause I don't think you can get a, it's funny on, on average, no one reaches this part of the video. I know. Right. <laughs> so you guys just need to watch the just end. Watch the way it ends. Watch the end. We just, you know, we give free stuff. Sometimes the middle, we might play a trick, right? Because we don't want you just, just skipping through the, the video. Just, just put it in the video. background. It's entertainment, right? Just I put think. it. In the, just, just don't even. I mean, I if, you don't, if you don't want to watch it, just don't, put it in the background and like listen for the word word giveaway. And then it's like, oh, giveaway! Now, now I can pay now, attention. Now, now I will. Hold pay on. Attention. Pause. Pause. Let me, let me watch this whole thing. Uh, but yeah, so uh, make sure you guys like, subscribe. If you're in the contest, if you're interested in the contest, subscribe to the channel. Put the comment on the MSI 970 video. Yeah, the biggest thing is to subscribe. You know, if you like or dislike, that's up to you guys. I mean, we, we obviously, we make this contact because we enjoy it. If you guys like it or dislike it, you know, that's the, your opinion. And that's, you know, you're going to choose that. We're not going to tell you to like it or not. But make sure you're subscribed and leave a comment because those are the two biggest things that we want you to do. If you don't do both of those things, then we... That's that's the rules. That's yeah. the rules. So if I, you we don't appreciate follow the, the rules, comments definitely. Absolutely. But absolutely, absolutely make sure you are subscribed to the channel if you want to be included in the contest. Uh, that is the first thing we check as soon as we, we pick out a winner. I check if if uh, both conditions have been met. Yep. Um, so if if and if you guys are interested in the gaming mice, no one no one has commented. I might have to repost on Instagram and Facebook. Right. But on Instagram and Facebook, if you like the page and comment on the video or uh, if you don't have Instagram do you, it on Facebook if you don't have Facebook you do it on yeah, Instagram if you, follow us on, if, you, if you follow us on Instagram and comment on the video you got we got the two game mice that we're giving away too yeah, yeah. otherwise we're just gonna do like a live stream and just like just like give random away. questions because I, I mean I want to I want this stuff is literally taking up space in my house I want to give it to you yeah we guys I mean you're not paying for shipping nothing we're we're handling everything we, got you. we just domestic only North domestic America, only please. for we, now guys I wish cause, I could because shipping is triple it's not the amount worth it. it's is just not than worth the it. product we're giving away so it's not worth it so we're we're 125 subscribers thank you guys so much yeah absolutely that's it. huge i mean in a year to get 125 i'm extremely i'm so happy. i'm so excited we haven't we're done, over 14,000 views yeah which is and we haven't we haven't like, done any kind I, of advertising yeah, either i think that 14,000 people have seen my face just in my head that that's know, an insane right? that's number insane. there's like 14,000 people it's just like an incomprehensible thank you number guys to by me, the so. way thank you much appreciated um, you know, like, comment, subscribe. If you guys any anything you want to say to us, you let us know. If you guys have any ideas, any videos, uh, somebody asked for a, a demo of the dust cycle, so I'm gonna do a quick video and post that. Uh, <laughs> so we'll definitely, uh, yeah. I mean, you guys have any suggestions? Let us know. Absolutely. Uh, but yeah, Cerebro, Full Throttle, signing off. See you guys next time.